Hey YouTube, Aaron with Vacant Land Guys here. Got another property here for you. It's uh, 39.94 acres in uh, St. John's, or just outside of St. John's. 16 minute drive to St. John's. Uh, we're asking 12,500 or terms. We'll do uh, 1,500 down and uh, 400 a month for 36 months. Uh, check out right here, choose your payment option and then go through your checkout. Check out right online with the credit card. Go to the property, you know, do your due diligence, uh, make sure it's what you want, and uh, check out right online with your phone. Just click right through, and simple as that. Uh, we try to make it pretty easy. Um, here's pictures of the area. Um, it's a great horse property, good cattle property. Um, it's really flat. Uh, it's in a POA, so the roads are maintained. Uh, so there's no issue getting onto the property, so it should be pretty easy access. Um, you can see the roads right here. The, there's an unnamed road that runs right along the north side of the property. Uh, I'll show you how to get there. Uh, right, here's the property again. Here's 61. Runs right along the uh, east side of the property. Well, to the east, a little ways of, of the property. You know, I'll fly you in a little bit closer show you how to get there. Uh, 17 minutes to St. John's. Um, quick little trip, going to town, get some groceries, get some supplies, grab a bite to eat, do your laundry. Um, Concho's 31 minutes away. Um, flights, oh, excuse me, Phoenix, uh, four hours, five minutes away. Um, Flagstaff, I believe, here. Yeah, Flagstaff, two hours and 33 minutes away. Uh, so, kind of give you an idea where you are in the world. Uh, yes, yeah, 39.94 acres, uh, almost to 40. It's a, lot, it's a lot of land, guys. Um, 40 is quite a bit. Um, great for your outdoor adventures. Bring your quads, kids, hunting gear. Make some memories there. Um, yeah, lots of uh, natural wonders in the area. You got the Petrified National Forest uh, pretty close to you. Um, lots of friendly people in the area from what I've, I've been hearing from uh, some of the neighbors in the area. Uh, pretty laid back. Um, nobody's gonna run you off or get mad at you if you're in the area driving on the roads or whatever. So it's, it's a pretty cool area. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, here's the terms. We already went over that. Closing dock fees. There's no dock fees on this one. Uh, most people charge $199 to $600 for dock fees. We're waiving all that stuff. Um, there's some more finance options. If you don't want to do the credit card route, you can do this, um, or you can do all cash. I mean, it's a pretty good deal for twelve thousand five hundred for forty acres. Um, GPS coordinates, you can click on this, and it'll take you to a GPS location right here. Show you exactly where. That's the center of the property right there. Um, that was three sixty-three fifty. We'll, uh, we'll go over that here in a minute. Um, Here's your GPS corner coordinates. Um, you can plug set into your. Let's take this right here. Show you how to do this. Copy. You want to. This is one set of coordinates. And I believe that's one of the corners of the property, and you can just plug in each one separately, and actually mark the corners of your property, and uh, kind of walk the boundary of your property. You know exactly where you are. Um, I wouldn't uh, survey it that way, but uh, I'd hire someone to come in. And uh, survey the count, survey it from the county, um, just to make sure it's it's correct. I mean, these GPS coordinates are pretty darn close, but uh, get a professional to do it if you really want to. I mean, you don't have to; it's totally up to you. But uh, this gives you a really, really, really close idea of where the actual boundaries are. Uh, taxes are one eighty-seven uh, and sixty-four cents annually. It's in a POA. It's one hundred fifty dollars to maintain the roads. Um, I'm not sure. Sometimes this comes with uh, a well, but I don't know. You have to do your due diligence. And I do your due, due diligence and all this stuff. I mean, this is, we do as much as we can. Um, try to find out everything we can, but, you know, things change and we can't keep up to date with everything. So, um, uh, you always want to do your due diligence. Call the county. Um, check out everything yourself. Um, legal description, um, parcel number. Acreage. This is the uh, POA. It's in, it's in the Carrizo Ranches uh, POA. Uh, Carrizo Ranches lot. 
352 is kind of the, the legal description. But uh, yeah, this is it. Carrizo Ranches, that's the POA it's in. Um, so that's who you that's where your $150 a year would go to. Um, that uh, guarantees you access to your property. Uh what else? Oh, let's jump over maybe Google Maps wanted to show you. Um, the Little Colorado River runs right along here. So you're really close to this Little Colorado River. Um, this is the property right here. It's the center of the property. Little Colorado River is right over here. Um, let's, get out of this here. Um, let's go over to Google Earth. So I just put the property boundaries here. Um, so this is probably the easiest way to get to the property. Just back it up. You're going to come down 61. Um, I don't know if you're coming from the north or the south, but uh, if you're coming up from the south, uh, it's like 191. Yeah, it's 191 and 61. I guess it's the same thing. See that? It's 191 and 61. I guess that's the same highway. So you come down there, and then you come over here to looks like uh, Highway 6350, and uh, you can turn down here, come down this road here, and then. You're going to make a right up this road here. And then you're going to kind of loop around here and loop around here. Come up this road here. And then you're going to make a left on this road here. And this runs right along the north side of the property right here. So, pretty good access, it looks like. Um, so, yeah, and the, uh, the POA maintains these roads. Uh, so, you shouldn't have any issues. Uh, you can see there's uh, somebody over here. Looks like they're they're doing it. Looks like they got a little you know, little house there. There's solar, so they're going off grid here. Um, looks like a little water water tank there. So they're probably getting water delivered. Um, maybe they're maybe they're doing water catchment. I don't know. Also another little house around here somewhere. So we've got like little ponds here, little pond there. This one's really close to the property. It looks like a little frog shape, frog shaped ponds here, and there, and then the little Colorado River is just right over here. I think that's it right there. Maybe yeah, that's it right there. Um, yeah, you know, like green is. That's probably it. The little Colorado. Uh, yeah, so that's uh, that's kind of it. Uh, well, actually, let me zoom in here. Show you, show you the road, so I can zoom in really good on Google Earth and actually get right on the street. So this is the road you'd be turning on down here. There's power running along this highway. So this is facing north. So you want to go down this road right here. Oh, it looks like it's paved. Okay, it's pretty nice. I wonder if it lets me. It's gonna let me go down there. There it is. Anyway, let's zip out of there. See if I can see if I can get on this road a ways. So this is the 6350. So there's a property there. Let's see if I can uh, jump down right into here where you make that turn. So this is where you go up. Oh yeah, cool. So this is where you. Well, it's not going to give me an actual. Uh, a real image. This is like satellite image. So you go down this road here, dirt road, and then make those turns, and your property's going to be kind of over here. But yeah, it's a dirt road. Um, looks like there's transfer lines running across here. Property's right up here. So yeah, come down here, zip up here, up here, up here, and then come over here. That's it. Um, all right, this is Aaron with Vacant Land, guys. Uh, you know, if you have any questions, uh, twelve thousand five hundred or terms, uh, fifteen hundred down, four hundred a month for thirty-six months. Um, check out right here. Check out on your phone when you go check out the property. Um, and uh, if you're out there, take some pictures. Um, if you, if you don't want to buy it, uh, 
send me some images and I'll you know, give you a better deal on another property you find or something. Uh, here is our contact info if you need to reach us. Uh, Liz at vacantlandguys.com or 971-225-7024. Here's our fax. Here's our address. Uh, all right. Thanks, guys.